Hi guys and welcome back to a, another FIFA 20 video on how to get unlimited packs. Um, the reason I'm releasing this today is due to obviously team of the year dropping and I feel like the previous video I'd done was quite outdated. Um, there was different SBCs and that which weren't really relevant so I've decided to kind of re-release a new video that kind of goes over the basics of it. I'm not going to go fully in depth on the bronze pack method again because I know you guys have already watched them videos but what I will do if you haven't seen it before is I will pop a link up the top I'm trying to where's my hand but around here somewhere it'll pop up um, I'll pop a link up top and then I'll also pop a link in the description down below on the bronze pack method where I'll just go fully through that but so firstly I know I'm not going to go through it, I've just said that I'm not going fully through the bronze pack method but I just want to show that bronzes are selling at the moment um, these are just off kind of one batch I've still got loads more to sell um, from the major leagues, I just want to update you guys on what the leagues are that you want to sell so if you're doing the bronze pack method you firstly want to have a look um, what's in marquee matchups, I don't think I'll be able to go into it can I? yeah so for example you might have some Olympiacos or Panathinaikos players um, or Porto, Sporting, Napoli, Inter, or Sevilla Athletic. You might have some of them. Um, so if you do, just put them in. That it's that easy. And then you want to go through and have a look at all the main main leagues from the league SBCs. Obviously, this changes as it gets updated all the time. Um, so you've got the Championship, the Bundesliga, the Chinese Super League, League One Conformer, um, Major the well the MLS. Uh, Liga Noz, Serie A, Saudi Professional League, the Super League, the Premier League and the Eredivisie. So there's loads of leagues now to sell which makes this method so much more profitable. Um, this is, by the way, this is route one on how to get unlimited packs. I've got another one I'm going to go into a bit later in the video. Um, depending on how long this goes, it might be that we do one video on this method and we do a part two um, where we have a video that pops, say, tomorrow where we go into how to get more packs again. So we'll have to kind of see how we go on that. Um, so first I'm just going to clear these off the transfers because it's annoying me. Right, so step one, as always, is the bronze pack method. Um, just, I'm going to do one pack quickly of it to show. Uh, so we go, oh, it's there. Literally, you open bronze packs, you chuck them in the club and you sell the valuable cards from the leagues I just said. You then go into the bronze upgrade pack, which is probably already full now in me. Uh, what we got? Oh, well, I'll do. And then I'm going to go squad builder. I'm going to go bronze. Oh, God. And I'm going to go for each tier of the leagues. Because as you can see, we just filled that straight up with one. Easy. We submit that off. You get a two silver player pack. That is fine. Um, you take that into the club. You open that silver upgrade pack, and then you go back to the silver upgrade. I'm gonna chuck it in here. Oh, got quite a few silvers already in it. What have we got? Silver. Let's have a look. Okay, yeah. So I've just done this. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna submit the silver upgrade squad off. There's so many ways you can do it. Don't use any of the important leagues. It's kind of the key thing. Chuck that in. I feel like I'm, I think I just saw quite an important league in there. Um, I'm not too sure though, so we might have to go just accept the loss. Once you've done the silver upgrade, you open the silver upgrade, and what you get from that is a three common gold pack. You get your three common gold players, and you chuck these into the gold upgrade pack. So, gold, low to high. But one thing I'm going to advise now, depending on how you want to do it, if you just want rare players and you don't want to get even more packs, just do this. But the big method's about to come. So this is, I suppose this is method one. I've managed to summarise it quite, I feel quite quickly. This video's probably going to be a little bit longer than usual. Um, but you don't want to be chucking in golds from usable leagues. So any ones with an SBC that aren't rare, you don't want to be chucking them in. There we go. Argentinian League's always got a bunch. I never get rid of the rare players just in case they release a good SBC. Or I have to because I've got a duplicate. Right. Just quick, just get this. There we go. So you use all the untradeable leagues and you fill up the squad like you can see here. Um, so these are all the ones without a league SBC. You put them in, you save all the other gold cards. The reason being is something I'm going to go into next. 
But that is how you get a free two rare gold player pack. Simple, really effective. Um, obviously, the more gold, uh, the more bronze packs you open at the beginning, the closer you're going to get to it. I will be releasing a video on maybe a different method for it um, in the coming days, so just keep an eye out for that. But at the moment, that's probably the best thing to do. Right. I forgot to say at the beginning, if you like the video, make sure to drop a like down below. It really helps support the channel. We've grown massively lately. So, and if you're new, make sure to subscribe. I really appreciate it if you would. It'd be great. Um, we saw another two bronze players. Look at that, 3,600 for Mangraviti. Um, that is because he's Brescia. Brescia players just sell. It's great. But if you smash bronze packs, you're going to get a lot of them, which is really good. What I'm going to do is, later on today, I'm going to put every coin that I've got into it. I've only got 64k at the moment. Um, but I've got, like I said before, loads of players to get rid of. So, just to show, um, as you can see, we've got loads of these. I can't find the pack we actually got from doing this. Um, that's, we've got the small rare silver players pack. That's from, no, it's not from the bro. I'm not going to lie. I've completely lost the ones I'm getting from these upgrades. Um... I have no idea where they are, but we have 69 packs, so I can't complain. Um, realistically, I should open these sealed packs, and I probably will, um, before Tim of the Year's out anyway, but it depends if I have time, because between now and then I'm quite busy, but we'll see. You've done that method. You've saved all the golds, bronzes, silvers from the valuable leagues that you've got from this pack. Um, you could either sell... You have a choice. You can sell all of the bronzes and silvers and golds that are tradable from them leagues, or you can keep them. I'd keep them, personally, because then what you can do is... My club isn't kind of stacked enough, really, at the moment to do that. Okay, so my system just froze, but I'm back. Um, luckily, managed to save some of the clip from previously. Um, yeah, so, like I was saying, my, my club isn't really stacked enough to do this method as of yet, but I will show you what you need to do. Um... I will probably get a few more of the leagues done. If you, you're you about to see me go into the basic understanding of doing a league SBC, um, I'll put a link down below. I've done the Premier League and the Championship, I believe, uploaded so far. So I'll put the links for them down below. Um, it's easy to go through. But I'm going to show you with the Chinese Super League, because that's one we've actually packed quite a few. Um, as you can see, a lot of these are in progress. So I've started to chuck players in, but never really finished it. Um, so what you can do, is if you go here and you go to the there we go Chinese Super League and you just have a look in each club what you've got so I already have four players and as I was like my club isn't really full of players at the moment so you chuck in that there that there a centre back and a goalkeeper that's why I already have just for this team um, I've not been stacking these packs over the last few days I've been I sold off a lot of the Chinese Super League sold off all the kind of other leagues and done the Premier League and then I've done the Championship but what you can do is if you've put enough coins into these methods um, you can as you can see I'm, I've got players from most of the teams who's that One, two three four five six six players from Chongqing um, and there's some clubs you don't get as many from yeah, so once you've got an amount you're happy with, you put them into the team and buy up the remainders. So you can go through, and you can go through this one, for example. I have six. I'm happy to buy five other players, depending on the price, obviously. Um, but if you focus on saving all them silvers, golds, from this method, you will rack up the entire, well, the majority of the Chinese Super League pretty quickly. Just make sure you don't get rid of them gold non-rares into gold rare packs when they are from a relevant league. Just stack all the pointless stuff. You can do that for any league. So obviously that's just the Chinese Super League, but we can go into the MLS. I think I've got quite a few MLS players in the club. I don't really know how many. But what you do is you go search, you go along to the MLS, which I believe is backwards. Yeah. And you have a look at club. So I have four players um, already from this club. So like I said, you can just chuck them in. Whether that be on the bench or on the pitch doesn't really matter. And then just move them into position. This way you can you can have a visual representation of what you already have. I 
So we've already got four players from the MLS, like I said, not been trying again. Let's have a look at other clubs though, if we've got many from other clubs in the MLS. Not majorly. There might be a club where we have a few, but I feel like I sold off quite a few of the MLS again. Oops. Um, but that's because I wanted to gain coins back. Like as an instant, rather than packs. This was all kind of prior to the team of the year build for myself. Um, whereas now I've hit the point where I want to stack team of the year. So at the moment though, if you do the first bit I was speaking about in the video, if you smash through loads of different packs, like bronze packs, and you sell off all the major leagues, so you sell off Premier League, La Liga, um, Bundesliga, you sell off the MLS, you sell off the Super League, so the Chinese League, as you, there's loads of them now, there's loads, look, they're all, they're all here under the, the League SBCs, these are all the ones you need to sell, and La Liga, I always add La Liga in, Air to be, there's loads now, but um, add them all in, if you sell them all, you'll make such a good profit, and then, you can repeat it. But, or, you sell them all borrowing one league. So if you decide, for example, there's a player you want, like for me, I decided I wanted Phillips in my video I'd done before. So what I'd done was, in order to get Calvin Phillips, I sold off all the other leagues borrowing the championship and bought loads. I'd done the same with the Premier League. When I decided I wanted to get a uh, Meyer, I sold off every other league to fund the bronze pack method, but kept the Premier League and reused and recycled and that way I just ended up in such a good profit from it so that he actually was near enough free um, which is huge which is huge so if that makes that's kind of the, the two methods on how to get unlimited free packs um, if that has been helpful for you make sure to like down below and subscribe if you've got any questions just comment if you have a question i will always try and reply um so yeah just comment down below i will catch up with the video uh, the comments as soon as possible the second i see a comment i'll try to get back to it um but if this isn't clear enough and you want a more in-depth method on each bit let me know down below and i'll make that happen but yeah thanks for watching make sure to like and subscribe and good luck in team of the year cheers